TGR. Okay, yo, yo, my god, oh, the energy, the energy. Guys, what's That's up? Holy, <laughs> holy god. I was not expecting this. This is totally unscripted. What's up, guys? It's your boy Onyx and my boy. It's Rudy. Guys, we are excited because uh the Xbox showcase partner showcase dropped today and there was a teeny little bit uh, first in engine look of metal gear solid delta snake eater which is the remake of metal gear solid 3 snake eater um rudy how excited are you for this this is my favorite metal gear like snake eater snake eater it's yes. so good yes. man like yes. come on like i i and it's funny because like i remember my first experience was on GameCube, then uh, Sons of Liberty, and then this, and this to me just yeah. like blew my mind, man. This, I am, yeah. please more. Dude, Snake, Snake Eater is a landmark title. And I mean, you know, the uh, Master Collection just came out and everything that I'm seeing is just, look how Snake Eater runs on PC. It's not the best, but it's there. And uh, people are working on it and it's great. I'm glad that Metal Gear Solid is back in the conversation because my God, it's been too long. It's been too long. I missed the hype cycle of a new Metal Gear Solid game. Uh, even though this is a remake, it's still a new a new game. And I think it's going to be a new vision, hopefully. Mm -hmm. um, so let's see. Without fur further ado, let's let's get into it. Likely Mature Likely 17. Mature. I, I've not we, seen we that. We don't, we don't know yet. <laughs> it might be. Yo, that's a bad that it, this looks pretty already oh, pre pre alpha okay. pre alpha look at that croc oh my look at that mud Dude. wow look at that mud like just <laughs> dripping off him oh sh ah. oh Oh, I thought it was gonna pull off. <laughs> yeah. The bridge, dude. Oh, the bridge. So much stuff happens there. Okay. Oh yes, you fight the uh, what's his name? The pain? In that in that cave? The crabs. A tree frog! That's not a tree frog. <laughs> oh man. Oh, but you save that one science and you fight Ocelot yeah. for the first time. Oh my yeah, god, dude! Ah! Dude, that looks great. What? That's insane. Yeah. How dude, crazy. this area? Oh. That Metal Gear Solid, be... bro. I feel like it's almost too good. Well, maybe that's why. It's Unreal Engine I... 5, dude. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. So first impressions, just just watching that. How how are you feeling? Uh, this looks amazing. It does. Like, it does look like, really good. Really amazing. Really amazing. Do you want to do you want to like rewatch it? Yeah, let's do a quick rewatch. Uh, switch it. Switch that. Uh, I don't know if you put the quality in 4K. I realized there's a 4K quality on here. Oh well, there it is. <laughs> yeah, they didn't realize either. Well, there checked. it is. <laughs> there it is. Okay. Anyway. Yeah, let's do a quick rewatch here. Okay. Uh, ready in three, two, one, play. Let's watch this again in glorious 4K because I want to see all the details, right? Of course. And I want to talk a little bit over it, right? So, yes, the bag. The bag is a big deal. The bag. But seriously, look, like, look at the look at the, the, the grass water, under the water. Like, yeah. Yeah, dude. Like, it is absolutely insane. I love how the mud moves here. With Snake as he walks by it. And then and how it falls off. Dripping. Yeah, dude. Yeah, yeah, this is crazy, man. Like, the animations look good. Oh, the crawling at the first person. Yes. No, that, that is insane. Insanely high, high quality uh, looking it's, game it's... here. It's insane, man. It's like I swear, it's almost too good. Look at the lighting there. Yeah, the water reflections like, and the everything. Of shadows. You it, right there in that shot with the snake. You could see raindrops hitting the leaves and like the stuff off the ground, the plants and everything. Look at the damage on his clothing. Yeah, you can see the stitching. 
Did that bird. That's a good looking bird. That's a bird. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's insane, dude. I, I it's it's almost un, uh, unreal. <laughs> oh, 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 oh shit! <laughs> oh my god, he said it, guys. That that looks really good. And and the thing is, right? I saw a little bit of discourse on Twitter today. Oh yeah, and um, yeah, I did see some discourse day, man, so on I, this. I, I wasn't on Twitter. What happened? Yeah, I mean, pretty much people are saying like, if you remember the original, right? Uh -huh. And if you want to pull up here real quick. Oh, okay. 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 Right, ahead, well, full screen that, and you can just we can talk. Okay. Um, so if you if you see this this gameplay footage, right? Right. Um, what type of character? You look on? look at look look at the color, look at the filter, right? Look right. at the feeling and the vibe. Right. That's like very yellow, very green, very right. earthy and warm. Right. The remake doesn't have that. If you look at the remake footage, it's very blue and cold and cool. Mm -hmm. Very opposite of this. And right. the discourse is that the remake is obviously losing that soul that the original had. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Um, and I can kind of understand that because when I think of Metal Gear Solid 3, I think of this. I think of the very yellow game, a very green game, a very mm -hmm. like jungle Vietnam like kind of shit that, that Kojima really wanted to tap in. The w very war look right it's very war like film film war film like mm -hmm. and i get it. it it's very synonymous with metal gear solid 3 mm -hmm. but in my opinion this is a remake for a remake it's a new vision it's hopefully a reimagining of sorts because i don't just want the same game i want something slightly different like resident evil 4 and to a lesser right. extent like final fantasy 7 remake because that game changed a lot i don't necessarily need that huge of a change right, i just want right. something new you know, a new vision. So um, I think the game looks really good. I think it's a good start. I want to see gameplay. Right. Gameplay will will really make or break the game. Because if you remember, Kojima was really good at, at creating these systems. Kojima was very good at directing these game, game developers to create some good shit. And the gameplay and the combat and the stealth in these games is incredible. It's mm -hmm. bar none. Like right. Phantom Pain was the pinnacle of that shit, but Metal Gear Solid Three was no no slouch either. When we played that game, it was like, wow, what a what a natural evolution to what came with Metal Gear Solid Two. You know, mm -hmm. it just made so much sense. The camo system, the way like the time would pass, like it's just oh, it's good, it's good. So right. as long as they retain that, I'm all in for you know the new Metal Gear Solid game, the remake. Yeah, I mean for me, it, it's like. I look at this and I look at it as a product of its time. Uh, and I don't mean in the setting of the world that is Metal Gear Solid 3, right. but more of like when it was released. Because around that time, not only were games following that same uh, color palette, but cinema was also following that color palette. And who pays attention to a lot of cinema? Kojima. Hideo Kojima. That man, Hideo Kojima. Kojima knows, he knows, he, he, he loves movies. Exactly. <laughs> Follow him on Twitter, you'll see that. <laughs> exactly so he watches a lot of film so he, he followed that same trend of keeping that the oranges the warm tones and and that was a product of his time another yeah. game that saw a similar type of treatment is shadow of the colossus with its right. remake from blue point because right. the original game was very 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 yellow type, very warm yeah, yellow yeah. warm similar uh, color palette and when it came out that re-release by blue point it was definitely very blue more, very cool no, no pun intended yeah. but very blue as well <laughs> um so looking at this like i'm like I, I i'm kind of in the same vein as you man like i'm okay with a new reimagining in terms of like visuals and how it's presented um but i do think that gameplay will go ahead and be the definitive factor on whether or not this is going to be a successful remake yeah uh, yeah because if, if yeah. it ain't fun to play if the mechanics suck it's not going to be good no matter yeah, what i agree name is behind it yeah man. Um, no totally totally i'm okay with the visuals 100 yeah. percent. like yes it looked amazing i just i want to see more yeah and, and, and you know what the one good thing about metal gear solid 3 looking different is that we now have access to metal gear solid 3 the original Right. With Shadow of the Colossus, unfortunately, if you don't have a PS3, you can't play the original game anymore. You can just play the remake. And that's where it's like, I wish we still had access to the original game, right. to the original HD collection. At right. least for Metal Gear Solid, we have it. 
hopefully one day we have access to shadow of the colossus and eco in their original form mm -hmm. uh but till then awesome. you know once you got a ps2 or the ps3 hd yeah. uh collection like you're sol yeah. on that front or emulate that shit i guess <laughs> <laughs> the only way to preserve titles nowadays it seems yeah right right but anyway guys uh let us know what you think in the comments below Did this uh sell you are you ready to see more do you want to play it do you hate it tell us how wrong everybody is for even thinking this looks good and and, and i will probably not respond <laughs> but <laughs> anyway guys thanks so much for hanging out with us in this evening well or morning or wherever you are when you're watching this and uh we'll see you in the next one later I guess. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to see more and stay up to date, subscribe, hit the little bell, and join our Discord. If you want to support the channel, please check out our Patreon or hit the join button below. As always, thanks for your support and thanks for watching.